In this example, we have a rectangular lamina that's of height 12 centimetres and width 32 centimetres, and it's going to be suspended from point A. We need to find the angle that the 12 centimetre side would make with the vertical. So, when I suspend it from point A, what's going to happen is that uh, vertically, we'll have from point A going through the centre of mass. Now, the centre of mass is dead centre of your rectangle, of course. So, uh, it'll be this point here, say. So, that point there is 16 centimetres long and 6 centimetres up. Okay? So if I draw a right angle triangle here, then uh, you could just do it as one big right angle triangle, that's true. Um, but just for the sake of having our centre of mass identified, I'll write that as 16 centimetres and that as 6 centimetres. So the angle I'm interested in is that angle there. So theta is going to be the inverse tan of the opposite over the adjacent, so 16 over 6. And so, inverse tan of 16 over 6 is 69.4 degrees to three significant figures. Okay, so when you're doing a problem like this, you don't need to redraw the shape and imagine what it's going to look like. It's much easier just to keep with the image that you have, think about drawing a line from your point of suspension to the centre of mass, and then using the base and height of a right angle triangle, work out the angle theta.